Hi, I'm Holly Wilson. I am Delaware Nation and descendant of Delaware Tribe of Oklahoma Lenape, and I'm a storyteller. For me, creation is all about stories, and so I have to kind of be inspired by something I see that then triggers an idea that then I begin to make. And I'll normally start with, like it could just even be the way the trees reflect a shadow on the ground. And like we had this great snow a couple of years ago and it was deep for Oklahoma and all the trees had their like dead seed pods and they were casting these beautiful shadows. And then you had like these footprints in them. And so I photographed that because I know I'm gonna use it in a piece. And I might do a sketch of what that could be around a thing and I'll make notes. And then from there, I'll depending on what it will go with. Because for me, I won't make a piece I won't cast a piece or finish a piece till I understand how it's all gonna go together. So I have things that kind of stay in these weird kind of fragmented sections until the whole thing comes together. And recently I've been adding new materials. So glass is what I'm doing now. So it's a whole other kind of way of working, which is kind of exciting, exciting to see. So it's really about this story and what the meanings are, and then I'll pull material to represent what that meaning is. So like cedar represents mother, and it's also what we use to purify um, an area, a space, a person. So that's why cedars become my number one wood choice I use when I do my bloodline pieces. But bronze is so strong, I can make a figure stand on its tippy toe. So it's kind of like my baseline neutral for things. And then glass has become this thing that I think of as a lens and how we look through because it's this transparent medium, but it's the representation of what that transparency is that feeds back into the work itself. And so that's really where I'm kind of moving with my work and adding in, you know, clay again and glass is new, photography becoming a real prevalent part. And then all the things that are nature, I grow. So it's also looking at what we do on our land and how the plants are being affected and how our earth is being treated. So it's kind of like this all interweaving thing of life in a way, so. Like everything I heard from my family about who we were was through my mother, through her grandmother, from her mother, through her great grandmother. And I'm still going back through trying to find all these like seeds, these little things to plant to hopefully grow and connect back to who we were. And then the piece I did for this show, or the piece that I have in this show, it's about women. It's all about the stories of our mothers, our grandmothers, and the stories that are passed down. So the seeds are the stories. The seeds are the children. The seeds are the food that we moved from all the different locations we were relocated. So that's the whole idea of the seeds in the piece.